let's calculate the limit we see on the screen that is the limit when x approaches to infinite of 2x squared minus 3x plus 1 divided by minus x squared minus 4 we have the limit of a quotient of polynomials so by the limits properties as we have polynomials and the x tends to infinite the numerator and the denominator it's infinite so from here we can see that we have an indetermination numerator is equal to infinite and the denominator also is equal to the infinite so we would have infinite divided by infinite for solving this in determination what we have to do is dividing the numerator and the denominator by the x with the biggest exponent on the whole fraction so we can see the biggest exponent is 2 so let's divide everything by x squared dividing the numerator we will have 2x squared minus 3x plus 1 divided by x squared and the denominator would be minus sx squared minus 4 divided by x squared this limit is equal to let's divide every monomial by x squared to make it easier to solve so we would have 2x squared divided by x squared minus 3x divided by x squared plus 1 divided by x squared and on the denominator we would have minus x squared divided by x squared minus 4 divided by x squared now let's simplify every fraction we have here 2x squared divided by x squared there's just a 2 left minus 3x divided by x squared is 3 divided by x plus 1 divided by x squared and on the denominator we would have x minus x squared divided by x squared is minus 1 minus 4 divided by x squared and now every term divided by x is equal to 0 as x approaches to the infinite so the limit would be 2 minus 0 plus 0 divided by minus 1 minus 0 this is equal to 2 divided by minus 1 so the result is minus 2 this is the result of the limit you were asked to solve